Yeah! Good morning team. Welcome to December. It's officially Christmas and I'm gonna just move there. Brilliant. So it's December, it's Christmas time and uh, we're gonna celebrate Christmas in my style I guess. Well not my style, Sam's style because we're at Sam's today and um, yeah we're gonna go into town and buy some bits of Christmas stuff because it's Christmas. I've got my special meeting um, and then we're gonna also just go to Prezos and stuff and do Christmas stuff. I'm missing my moustache. It feels really weird to not have a moustache um, and I don't know what I'm gonna do without it so I'll have to do something else. I was thinking maybe growing a beard for December um, what do you think guys? Should I grow a beard? Comment down below um, if I should or if I shouldn't. Uh, we shall see you later. So we're back from town and we're all Christmased up. As Christmased up as we'll get. Um, I had a good meeting and then me and Sam went for lunch. And then we just got some... we done this thing, right? I'll, I want you guys to try and do it. It's the Pound Shop Challenge. Uh, Sam introduced it to me. And so you go into uh, Poundland or a 99p shop and you have to buy something for your other half that, yeah, so a gift that the other person will like. And me and Sam done it and we came out with, weirdly enough, the same thing. And now we're home and we're just trying to decide where to put the Christmas tree. So that is, not probably, it's the end of the 1st of December. I hope you guys have had a brilliant 1st of December and that you've all put your trees up uh, like we have. Look at that tree glistening and beautiful. Yesterday I went to London. Awful day. Um, so today is kind of everything changes. I'm starting a new job and the start of my new job starts with night work. Um, I'm actually working with adults with learning disabilities uh, in my new job and yes, uh, tonight I start my first um, eight, nine hour shift doing that. Um, I've never kind of done this type of work before so it's going to be a very very different kind of thing. I've worked with adults but not with adults with learning disabilities and not on a night shift. Um, so yeah that I've got a lot of night shifts over the next two weeks. I've got about six, seven um, but basically that's three a week. Um, I know it's not anything major uh, but I'm a very busy bunny over the next 20, 30 odd days uh, with Christmas and everything else that's going on. I've just come back from my uh, first night shift at my new job and it went really well I guess. Um, it was, it seemed quite easy. Um, there's a lot of mental attitude you've got to have to the job and um, yeah so it went quite well. So thank you for all who have uh, thought about me on my first day. And um, yeah, I'm going to go to sleep now because I'm shattered. I would say good morning to you guys. But the thing is, is that it's four o'clock in the afternoon. And that's not morning. Uh, so yeah, I've just kind of woken up, got dressed and sorted myself out ready for tonight. 
Uh, I'm doing another eight hour shift um, at my new job. I've got another one tomorrow night, essentially. And then that's me done. Uh, I've got the weekend off because me and Sam are going to Windsor Wonderland. Um, so hopefully tonight will go better than last night did. Um, I think it's just nerves and settling into a new job. I found a little bit kind of um, s scary. Y you know how new jobs are. Um, and the type of job that it is is uh, a lot different to um, the work that I've done. And I guess I've got to get used to that. And it's it's a good challenge for me. I get good experience from it. Um, I learn how to use certain pieces of equipment that I've seen being in use, but not with not with other people um, who are in the situation that they are. So I shall see you guys later.